Aloha guys, Scuba Chris here. I want to talk to you about the importance of bait thread. Now, in the States, we have the Atlas mic that's 100 feet, okay? And, you know, I've got this from China a while back. It comes in a box, as I think at the time was six in a box. It's 100 yards. And that box costs as much as the one roll of 100 feet. So make up your mind which one you want, okay? But this bait thread, see, take a look at this. This is nylon, look at this. Stretches to an unbelievable amount. Wrap around your bait, pull it, breaks. See that? So this is what I use for my hooks when I go baiting. And the reason why I use this is because it holds the bait on longer to the hook. You're gonna have a lot of little fish around, they're gonna keep picking at it, pulling at it, and you know, the bait's gonna eventually come off. Use this, it's gonna stay on longer, and a few extra minutes may mean the difference of catching a big fish or no fish. So let me give you a quick demonstration. Now me, I have everything prefabricated. I don't believe in doing things on the spot, okay? So all my pre-made leaders are like this. Look at that. All pre-made. Alrighty. So what I so like say if I want to use soft bait. Now in Hawaii we got the bait fish here called Nehu. This is a Nehu. So if we try to hook this through, it's gonna be torn up so easy because it's so soft. All right. So what I do is, is I get a couple of them, all right? Get a couple of them and I position it. Um, you can do whatever you want, but I position so the heads are right above the eye of the hook and I'll show you why. Okay, see that? Now I'm gonna get some bait thread. Okay, so see that? What we're going to do is we're going to use the bait there above the eye of the hook. Give a couple wraps. See that? It's above the eye of the hook. Now we're going to go the same distance below the eye of the hook to wrap, to, to make another wrap. See that? So we're going to go below the eye of the hook. Pull. See that? That pull, it just breaks, but look at that. Isn't that nice? So now that bait is adhering to the hook. It's gonna hold on a lot longer. This is why I use bait thread, right? I just wanted to give that quick demonstration so you would understand how important that is because if you go out and use any kind of soft bait, like say uh, shrimp is another soft bait. I do the same thing with shrimp, but as you notice, I'll do above the, the eye of the hook and I'll go another wrap below, pull it, so, and when you pull it, see how it cuts in? Notice that, how it cuts in right there? So when, when that thread cuts into the bait, that's what's gonna hold it on, all right? This is not a big secret, I've been using this for a while. Actually, uh, I don't know too many people in Hawaii that do this, they just hook it, throw it out, now the 10, 15 minutes later, um, you see the, 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 the bell or the line going ding, 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 and they have to replace it. I can last like this for half an hour or more, all right, because it's tied on. This, this bait tape is really good to use. It's made on a nylon and it stretches. So give this a try. I, I promise you it'll increase your game. Thank you.